सेल्फ केयर डे towards the end of the video we're going to have a Q&A hey guys so it's another warm day here in Toronto and today is self care day so if you can see my t-shirt it says more self care so yeah aaj today is my day to just relax do nothing just chill and you know get the energy back i have a day off today from work so i'm going to spend that just relaxing and i'll take you along with me so a lot of you guys keep asking ki uh, when you're abroad when you're living alone things might get really depressing lonely a lot of times so yes that does happen which is why we need days like these where you kind of rejuvenate yourself and enjoy so self care can be a lot of different things like i love catching up on sleep to aaj main kafi der tak soi relax kiya and then i'm stepping out of my house and for me another thing that i really like doing is going to the lake and i keep mentioning that there's a lake really close to my house so today is the day when i'm going to finally show you that lake and also back home i used to read a lot dheere dheere wo kam ho gaya and yahan aake bahut hi kam ho gaya padhna so i'm going to go to the lake i've carried a book with me so i'll chill over there for a while and read a book so that's going to be my relaxing day so let's go So guys, summers are all about being outdoor and gardening and flowers over here. So I am outside this garden center. So it's a really seasonal thing. It happens only like five to six months in the whole year. जहाँ पे it's like a nursery with a lot of plants, flowers. So I'm gonna go in and check that out. And on a side note, because ये सारी seasonal चीजें खुल जाती हैं summer में, it's also a great opportunity for part-time jobs. So Yeah, you can check out these places if you wanna get pattern jobs. Also, guys, a few videos back, I had asked you guys to ask a few questions to me, and I'll answer them. So today, I'm going to be picking the most common ones of them and giving answers. So towards the end of the video, we're going to have a Q and A. ओके हाफ ड्रिंक डाउन and let's head to the lake now thodi si dhoop kam ho gayi it's around 6 pm yes guys 6 pm and itni dhoop hai and this is going to stay till 8 9 so we still have a lot of time to spend at the lake so guys we are finally at the lake you can choose to sit at the benches or on the grass or near the lake so i'm going to go close to the lake and sit on the rocks guys finally at the lake i found a nice bench really close to the lake right there so i'm just going to relax here and read my book So guys it's been around 20 25 minutes that I've been chilling here reading a little I'm just relaxing and this feels so good like I wish they had this kind of weather all the year long because this feels so nice I just love being outside hearing the birds chirp just close to the lake it's so calm and nice and also guys along with that reading I really miss doing this and I wish I can continue it I'll try to do it at least हफ्ते में दो तीन बार तो if not coming to the lake, I at least read at home. I'm hoping I do that. I hope I stay motivated to read because this feels so good and it's it's making me get away from my screen time because I've been realizing that 
मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम वन आई एम वर्किंग एम ऑन माई लैपटॉप ऑब्वियसली बट आफ्टर दैट जब मुझे फ्री टाइम मिलता भी है आई एम ईदर ऑन माई फोन और वॉचिंग टी वी सो आई स्पेंड सो मच टाइम जस्ट लुकिंग एट द स्क्रीन सो दिस इज दिस इज रियली नाइस टू ब्रेक दैट मो नॉट इन सो इट फील्स गुड आई होप आई कैन कंटिन्यू दिस नाउ बैक टू रीडिंग इट्स अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग बुक बाय द वे गाइज आई गॉट दिस फ्रॉम इंडिया इट सेल्फ एंड पाँच छः महीने हो गए थे मैंने बुक खोली भी नहीं थी सो टुडे इज़ द डे एंड आई स्टार्टड रीडिंग इट सो या लेट मी गेट बैक टू द बुक रीड अ गिड अ मोर एंड देन वी विल हेड बैक सो गाइज ड्रिंक भी ऑलमोस्ट ख़त्म हो गई है एंड आई गेट क्वाइट अ लॉट नाउ सो एंड बाय द वे फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू माइट बी वंडरिंग वॉट ड्रिंक दिस इज इट्स द पिंक ड्रिंक फ्रॉम स्टार बक्स and this is one of my favorite summer refreshers so if you want to try it it's the pink drink so now let's get to the part which i assume most of you are waiting for which is the q and a session so i picked out five of the top questions that i had from the previous videos and i'm going to be answering those right now so guys i got this one from a lot of you and i've been getting it multiple times which is what to pack and since we are almost heading towards august september jab a lot of you are going to come for your september intake so this is a good time to tell you what to pack now i do intend to create a separate video about it in detail what i would recommend you to get would be a few pair of indian clothes ek ya do just for like um events like diwali parties or when you feel homesick when you have a festival and you want to wear something like that so get that get a few utensils if you want i would recommend getting something like a pressure cooker because wo yahan pe kam milta hai milta bhi hai to kafi expensive hota hai so a pressure cooker would be something i'd recommend don't get stationery you can get all of that in dollarama so pens books all of those things dollarama mein mil jayega even plates cups ye sari cheeze aapko dollarama mein mil hi jayegi what i would really recommend is get a few clothes and get formal clothes if you want because you have presentations in which you will have to buy those things so these would be a few things that you should pack in your bag and guys be very careful don't go overweight because um they would charge you extra for that and one tip is if you are a student there are airlines which give you an extra bag just because you are a student so do ki jagah pe aapko teen bag mil sakte hain so check up with your airlines and see if that's a possibility so guys the second question is how do you deal with homesickness and is it easy to move abroad so guys i'm not going to say i'm not going to sugar coat it it is really difficult to move abroad and staying alone is the most difficult part you're used to having a big family and then yahan pe aake when you're all by yourself it's difficult but one thing that i would say is your friends are your family here so make good bonds make good friends and other than that aapke friends bhi aapke sath hamesha nahi honge they won't have time for you a lot of times so you need to learn to enjoy your own company you have to start doing things by yourself it took me a while to learn that but i'm getting there and that's exactly what i'm doing right now there's an ice cream truck behind guys do you hear that sound there's an ice cream truck behind me These roadside ice cream trucks are honestly a must try. Like, if you have a spot one, then you should get it. Um, usually, they only accept cash, so you need to have cash. That's just one drawback. But I have had this big drink, so I'm full. Uh, if not, I would have loved some ice cream. But yeah, these local ice cream trucks are amazing. They come only in summers, so. you should try it out we have to go to dinners on your own you will have to go to movies on your own so if you want to do something be ready to do it yourself and i'm learning to do that too and that is exactly what i'm doing today as well i'm learning to enjoy my own company and i'm getting there so that's how you get over your loneliness by always doing new things and enjoying everything around you <laughs> so guys number 3 is how do you select your college while planning to study over here So this is a little tricky one because everyone's ideal and best choice is different. So it's really depending on what you want. But I have a specific video on that which I'll link over here so you can check that out if you want to know it in detail. But in short, what I like doing is number 1 checking the college's ranking. 
because that really helps me know where the college stands. So number one, check the ranking. See कि वो Canada में कहाँ rank करता है. You get to know उसका reputation कैसा है. Next thing I like checking is the location of the college because this lets me know कि वो location में part time jobs मिलेंगे कि नहीं. कितना connected है वो location to get a full time job. So that is really useful. Another thing I like seeing is that past students उस college से कितने खुश थे. Maybe speak to a few alumni of that college to get to know how the college is. So these are the few things that you can use to select a college. Now related to colleges, the fourth question is fees for a PGDM course. So guys, every college has different fees, but it usually ranges from 16 to 20 thousand Canadian dollars. मतलब anywhere around 10 to 12 lakh rupees आपको लगेंगे to do a one year course. If it's two years, then उसका usually double होता है और a little less than double. But for one year course, it is around 16,000 to 20,000 Canadian dollars. Now again, each college has different courses, but average ये है. The fifth one and the last one is how do you get your parents to Canada? So a lot of you have been asking me, आपकी convocation आ रही and you want your parents to come here. So an easy way to do it is get them to apply for a Canadian visitor visa from India or your home country itself. Go through the processes, fill the documentation, and you can get a visitor visa for them. So they get the visitor visa, and then they can come to Canada. So it's that easy. The process is a little time-consuming. Usually, एक से दो महीने लग जाते हैं, but all depends on the Canadian embassy के वो उस time पे कितने packed हैं and कितना उनकी timelines क्या चल रही है. So you can check it on the CIC website to know कि उनकी timelines currently क्या है and get to know कितना time लगेगा. I'll link the website in the description too, so you can easily check it out. So guys, those were the five questions for the Q&A in this video. But guys, I know आपके पास और भी बहुत सारे questions होंगे and I'm going to be doing more Q&A soon. So if you have any other questions, then again drop them down in the comment section and I will pick a few of them. I'll try कि मैं कुछ videos में ऐसे ही पांच questions pick करके इनको answer करूं. Drop down all of your questions in the comments and I will pick them and I will answer you soon. So guys, hopefully ये vlog आपको entertaining and informational दोनों लगा हो and if you liked it, then as usual, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Let's make the family bigger. So let's do this. Um, we are at 54,000 now, which still feels unbelievable to me. But let's make this family even bigger now. So hope you guys enjoyed this video and see you guys again soon. Bye.